Yo, what is going on guys, Free here, back with another video on the channel today. I have a really exciting video because I traded for the whole CC4 Zomba set. Now you guys know I already had CC4 White Zombas from getting them in a trade up. Uh, why not play that clip on the screen right now? I got White Zombas! I got White Zombas! I got White Zombas! As you can see guys, that was me getting the CC4 White Zombas, which was insane. It occurred to me on Sunday that now I've got the hardest one to get, the hardest wheel to get out of the set. I can now try and get the whole set. No, I didn't go from nothing to every CC4 Zomba. I actually just used the stuff that was already in my inventory to try and get decent deals on Zombas. Now, yes, guys, some of the trades were decent and some of them were not. Please do not roast me in the comment section below. It was my decision. If there was a trade that you think was bad or was good, please comment it down below. Obviously, I'm looking for feedback for trading. Obviously, I'm not the best. So, yeah, it'd be awesome and useful if you guys that are good at trading out there could maybe help me or give me some feedback in the uh, comments down below. But, yeah, without spoiling too much and keeping this intro really long, I'm just going to keep it short and let you guys enjoy this video. So, I hope you guys do enjoy it, and if you did, make sure to subscribe, like, and turn on post notifications. And without further ado, let's get right into the video. Hope you enjoy. Okay, guys, so for the first trade, basically, I did a straight-up, simple little trade. Just going to make it quick. A parallax for Cobalt Zombos, all the profit for the trades. Will literally be on screen, so that was a pretty nice trade. Got him off the bat. I reckon it was a pretty fair share, like kind of trade, like fair. So this one was um, one from my friend Leighton. You guys may know him. He's been in a few of my videos before. So basically, he put in forest green zombers, grey zombers, lime zombers, orange zombers, burnt sienna zombers, and saffron zombers. Um, basically, I gave him two heats in a labyrinth, which I actually think was decent. I'm not gonna lie. I think that was around like a good trade. So basically, what I thought. When I was doing the trade was if I can get a whole bundle of zombies in one trade. Basically, it, the whole process of getting the zombies would just be so much easier. Getting the zombie set would be so much easier. Obviously, all the zombies were CC4 as well. Obviously, I want to collect that CC4 zombie set to make things easier. But yeah, that was basically the trade that me and Leighton did. Obviously, all of the zombies actually look really nice, guys. And I'm just going to show you them on the screen. So these... Are the zombies look at them they are awesome just having all of these painted zombies in my inventory felt so good and it was just absolutely insane to have them so if, i just want to thank everyone that um did these trades with me it was awesome trading with you guys and yeah thank you i guess so moving on to the next clip right here um basically just showing you guys all the zombies i've got so far obviously i have them white zombies from the trade up um, anyway, so let's get into the next trade. So this trade was done on a live stream uh, It was for his purple zombies and I gave him a I, I don't know it was it, it wasn't really an overpay for me due to how hard the lime loopers have been for me to sell They've been so hard for me to sell so here what I actually did was for this trade it was crimson zombies um, but mine were PCC and his was CC4. I was just make sure to check because like obviously I didn't really know this guy too well And obviously I don't want to get scammed. I'm not saying he was a scam I'm just saying I didn't want to get scammed So I was just checking that they were CC4, but I gave him PCC uh, what, uh, Crimson Zombers and 10 crates for his CC4 Zombers. I'm I was kind of desperate for the CC4 Versions of the zombies, so I didn't really mind uh, giving him crates I don't even know if that was a trade that was worth it. You guys can tell me in the comments down below So this trade I gave the guy a biomass free crates for um, pink zombies, I believe yeah so I thought that was a pretty nice trade. Um, obviously, the prices of everything will be on screen and the profit I made or lost will be on the screen as well. So obviously, I had the Cobalt Zombers. I need to get the Sky Blue Zombers. So for this one, I did a Slipstream and a Labyrinth with a, for a Sky Blue uh, Zombers. That was a pretty good trade. A lot of the trades were done with the same people because they ha had like half of the set already. So I basically just traded with them again. And then here is probably the biggest trade out of the lot. It is uh, Black Zombers, which range from 1.6 to 2x. Uh, Sorry if I'm talking to in X's to confuse people. It's basically how Xbox work on the spreadsheet. And obviously everyone knows the spreadsheet. So I'm just going to keep it like that for now. I'm not going to move on to like heats and anything. Um, because obviously to X's for me is just a bit easier. And hopefully it will be for you guys. So basically in this trade, the guy wanted um, a heat wave and a slip. And... Then I was like, okay, dude, let's do the trade. But then he wanted crates. So I put in the crates. And then I was like, can I change the overdrive crates to turbo crates? Because obviously I don't really like overdrive crates. But then the guy was like, no. Uh, no, then the guy was like, yeah, sorry. And in the end, I just said, well, the, the heat wave and the uh, this, uh, slipstream uh, certified. So can we just do the trade like that? So he was absolutely fine with that because obviously they had a certification. That was a pretty decent trade. I wouldn't say I made much profit in that trade. It was just a normal one-on-one -on -one kind of trade, in my opinion. So anyway, at this point, I had the whole entire Zomba set.
Okay guys, basically what I'm going to do is, obviously you just saw all the trades for the zombies, now I'm just going to open 10 crates because why not, I'm just going to do it for you guys, so let's just get right into it. So first crate, PCC crate, let's see how this goes, let's see if we can pull anything good, um, yes, so what are we going to get, we got a distortion, great start, a very rare, what a start, guys, what a start. Oh, wow, look at that. Alright guys, so what are we going to get in this crate and back to back distortion, great, just what you want. We have the f Okay guys, so we have eight keys left and I think two more PCC crates So we have two more shots of getting something decent in this crate Uh, hopefully we can get maybe on the last crate Maybe this could be the lucky one, come on, starting on a mystery Ending on a mystery maybe, come on, maybe, you know Come on, at least a paint's exotic, that'd be great Mate, even an import, if it gets to the point where I, I can even have an import That close to the import guys what a shame. I like the look of loopers. It's one of my favorite wheels in the whole entire game. So you never know, guys. You never know. It could happen. Or it could just make us be one off of a mystery decal. That is fine with me. Oh, no. Okay. Well, oh, screw it. Nitro crate it is, guys. It's the eighth minute right now. So we'll open the next one on the ninth minute. And we'll see if we get anything good. So, oh, mystery was right there. K2, unfortunately. It's certified, though. Then we'll open the last two with the jawbreaker method. Because you never know, guys. You could get something good. We could get something good in the jawbreaker time. Okay, fire plugs. Stop right there. I will take that. I can do a trade up and get a painted mantis. Which I know aren't the best, but it's still better than just normal fire. Wait, what? Painted fire plug. <laughs> that bad. That's actually quite good. Painted fire plug. All right, guys, we're now at the ninth minute. So we have three keys. Hopefully the jawbreaker method works as I made a video on it and it works for me in the past But can we prove it live? Probably not, but let's just see. Can we prove it live guys? No, if not, we got something worse. We got a rare decal. All right, please be something good. No an MGATA. Oh, no I mean if it's painted the jawbreaker works guys uh, No, it's okay. Let's move on. Oh electroshock how far you guys see that, that was a pretty good little opening i guess you could say like it looks pretty nice having all of those presented to me but no my luck we're gonna get an slk that's fine with me you know what i actually don't mind the painted fire pet fire plugs basically just was was okay for me that's how bad my crate luck is, is sometimes so i'll take that if you did enjoy make sure to smash that thumbs up button let's try and go for literally 2000 likes that would be insane that would literally be insane, guys. So, yeah, let's go for that. <laughs> Without further ado, let's end the video right here, guys. I hope you did enjoy this trading video. If you want to see more on the channel, maybe I might trade for some CT2 Voltaics in the future. You guys can sign down below in the comments section. And without further ado, let's end the video. Hope you guys enjoyed and peace.